After several days of quiet, high lava fountains returned to the summit of Kilauea on Tuesday morning. Episode 18 entered this vigorous phase of activity at 4.37 in the morning. As lava burst from the south vent inside the summit crater, and quickly reached heights of over 650 feet, or 200 meters. Smaller fountains also emerged from the north vent. The activity fed voluminous flows that covered 20% of the crater floor before sunrise. Strong deflation accompanied the activity, and seismic tremor increased. The plume of volcanic gas was going straight up into the sky due to calm winds. The Hawaii County Civil Defense issued this radio alert to nearby residents. This is a civil defense message for Tuesday, April 22nd at 7 in the morning. Hawaii Volcanoes Observatory has updated Kilauea Volcano Alert status to watch. A volcano watch means that the volcano is exhibiting signs of heightened or escalating unrest with increased potential of eruption in an uncertain time frame or an eruption is underway but poses limited hazards. Due to Kilauea's volcano watch, please be advised, south winds will cause volcanic gas Pelly's hair and tephra to impact the adjacent community in Volcano. Stay indoors or leave the area. You will be informed as conditions change. This is your Hawaii County Civil Defense Agency. Episode 18 actually started about a week ago with this precursory activity at the fence. Scientists anticipated that high fountains were on the way, but it took several days before the next phase began. During that time, the vents were mostly quiet with only an occasional lava flow observed at the summit crater. An uncrewed aircraft systems flight conducted by the USGS on April 18th revealed a small lava pond several meters down within the vent. The current USGS volcano alert level for Kilauea remains at watch with all activity confined to the summit area within Hawaii Volcanoes National Park.